Hagde Oositter, through you to the Honorable President, 22 years from today, actually exactly this day ago, South Africa became the Republic of South Africa on the 31st of May, 1961. On that day, South Africa got rid of British rule and of colonialism in South Africa. The preamble of our constitution says quite clearly, let's honor those who built South Africa. So let's honor those people who had the wisdom to get rid of British colonialism and British rule. Honorable President, do you refer to the crime situation in South Africa? Yesterday we received the latest crime statistics for the last quarter of last of the previous financial year. And the statistics is quite clear. It was the third consecutive quarter where violent crime in South Africa increased. If you look annually, total crime overall increased 7.24%. Contact crimes increased 8.5%. Murder increased 9.6%. We have 76 murders every day. When it comes to women and children, the murder on women increased to a staggering 20.25%. Now, Honorable President, if you look at the statistics and you look at jungle justice, 2,324 people were murdered by means of communities and jungle justice. That is proof that the community and the people of South Africa don't have trust in the police. They have to take the law in their own hands to protect them. But honorable president, I want to appeal to you today that you appointed the national commissioner of police, General Masimola on the 31st of March last year. As we speak, he still didn't receive a top secret clearance from the state security agency. That is unacceptable. In fact, that means if he looks at top secret documents that he is contravening the law. Now, I can't understand why it takes so long to get a clearance. I appeal to you. If you want to strengthen his hand to fight crime effectively, ensure that they do the right thing. Honorable says, President, I want to come to water. And I will for the Akbar President say, what I hear from you is that you have the benefit of what you from Eskom has, also with the water crisis in South Africa. That's a fact. It's got the cop. What I will today for you say, people can without electricity get clear. I have been growing without electricity. But people sterf as they don't have water of as water besoedel is. En daarom wil ek vir jy vraag, jy moet dit as een dringende krisis hanteer, nie soos in die geval van Eskom nie. Honorable Chair, President, after the COVID-19, I promised you that the Freedom Front will come forward with an economic recovery plan. I have it with me today, I'm going to hand it over to you. Because, Honorable President, under your presidency, Firstly, we see that the value of the rand weakened 40%. Unemployment increased 7%. We got grey listed. What is also quite disturbing is that 10-year-olds can actually not read with meaning as we look at the system of our education. The core of this proposal is a free market system. It was compiled by independent econ economists like Professor Yanni Rousseau and Mike Hollop. They have no links with the Freedom Front Plus. In fact, we had to pay for it. But it is in line with the policies of the Freedom Front Plus. And therefore, again, I urge, and it is also in this report, get rid of black economic empowerment and affirmative action. Some of the proposals here is that you replace black economic empowerment with best black economic skills transfer. Let's 
give skills to people to have a good business so that they can create jobs. Achbare president, ek wil ook vir jy sê dat die ANC en jy sê jy gaan nou werving doen onder minderheidsgroepe. Wittes, bruines en indiers vir volgende jaars verkiesing. Maar jy, die ANC het een nieuwe apartheid geskep in Suid-Afrika. Een nieuwe apartheid wat gebaseer is op ras. Want as jy gaan kyk na die nieuwe quotas wat gestel word, dan wil ek vir jy sê, dit is niks anders as apartheid nie. It took 33 years to get, get rid of apartheid till 1994. It took the ANC 29 years to get apartheid back. Al wat ek vir jy sê, as het gaan oor rechtstellende aksie, en ek verwijs hier na the song Sanzeni Na. It was one of the freedom songs. En al wat Sanzeni Na sê, wat het ons gedoen? Wat het ons gedoen? Ons enigste sonde is die kleer van ons vel. Stop die nieuwe apartheid. Ek dank u. Thank you, honorable member. Order, order, honorable members. Order, order, order. Honorable Groenewald. Honorable Groenewald. Order, honorable members. Order, order, order. Yeah, honorable members, don't cross the floor.